And now, our feature presentation. controller had borrowed a diesel. He told Duck to show the new engine round, but Diesel made mistakes, and the trucks began singing cheeky songs about him. Trucks are waiting in the yard, tackling them with easel. Show the world what I can do, gaily boast the diesel. In and out he creeps about, like a big black measle. When he pulls the wrong trucks out, pop goes the diesel. Duck was cross, and told the trucks to stop. But Diesel thought the song was Doc's fault. I'll pay him out, Diesel said to himself. But he couldn't think how. It's not fair, he complained to Henry, Gordon and James. I never get a moment's peace from these rude trucks, and it's all because of that duck. Nonsense, said Henry. Doc would never do that. That would be dis... dis... disgraceful put in Gordon. Disgusting, said James. Despicable, finished Henry. Diesel was not convinced. He spent the rest of the day wondering how he could get his own back. Next day, Henry's trucks chattered amongst themselves and paid no attention to him. They were very full and wanted to take it out on someone. Why not Henry? they whispered to each other. Wait until I give the word, said the first truck. At last, the signal went down. Come on, you, Henry ordered shortly. Reluctantly, and still chattering, the trucks followed him out of the yard. All went well until they reached the top of the hill. Steady, Henry warned the trucks. They heard, but they took no notice. Now! shouted the front truck. Go on! Go on! yelled the trucks. As surging against Henry's tender, they pushed as hard as they could. Stop! Stop! wailed Henry, and his driver braked as hard as he dared. But Henry couldn't hold the heavy trucks properly. His wheels locked, and he slivered out of control, down the hill, with the stupid trucks cheering and shouting behind him. Help! Help! whistled Henry despairingly. Thomas, waiting in the branch line platform, saw Henry coming, but he could do nothing to help. But the hill ended before reaching the station, and Henry was at last able to bring the silly trucks under control. Gradually, his driver eased off the brakes. When he was sure that the trucks were behaving themselves, Henry came to a complete stop. Phew, he said. What stupid things trucks are. They could have caused an accident. Never mind, said Thomas. They didn't. That's the main thing. You did well to stop them. Thomas puffed away, and after a while, Henry set off again. But something strange seemed to have happened to his wheels. Each time they went round, there was a clunk when they reached a certain spot. What's that? he asked after a while. You've got a flat tyre, said the driver. What? objected Henry indignantly. Engines don't get flat tyres. Only cars and lorries and buses like Bertie get them. His driver laughed. It's the truck's fault, he explained. All that sliding on the hill, with your wheels locked in the same place, has worn a flat place on each of your driving wheels. You'll have to go to the works, I'm afraid. They clunked to the end of the line, and Henry went crossly to the shed. Duck was there, and Diesel. 
What's the matter, Henry? asked Doc. Those trucks been playing you up, have they? Yes, they have, snorted Henry. Pushed me down the hill, and now driver says I got flat tyres. Ah, said Doc. Bumpy, that. But you can't trust trucks, can you? Ah, oh, well. I hope you get your flat sorted out all right. And he puffed off to see about the next train. Diesel sniggered. He had just had an idea. Next day, he spoke to the trucks. That was a good trick you played on Henry, he said. He's got flat tyres now, and has gone to the works to have them replaced. He paused. I shouldn't really tell you this, he went on quietly. But I know you won't pass it on. Do you know Duck's new nickname for Henry? Old Square Wheels. Good, isn't it? Don't tell anyone I told you. The trucks promised. But, as Duck had said, you cannot trust trucks. When Henry came back from the works, the whisper went round. Here's Old Square Wheels, it said. Old Square Wheels is back! As Diesel had expected, it was only a matter of time before the trucks told Henry that Duck had invented the nickname. I'll give him Duck, Henry said furiously. Just wait till I see him again! The trucks sniggered, and Diesel smirked with satisfaction. That worked well, he said to himself. Now, what can I think up about Gord?